Okay, so next up we got Doc. So this is gonna be something that a lot of people are gonna be talking about, I'm sure. Doc has lost his ACOG on the MP5. Yo, what's going on everybody? It's Shark with DG. And really quick before the video starts, I just want to say thank you to Ubisoft once again for letting me come out and play this uh, new season. So thank you very much. And of course, to everybody who has uh, been supporting me and helping me reach this point. Thank you so much. Uh, anyways, onto the video. So today I'm going to be going over all of the new optics and the settings for the optics and the reticles and all of that. So to start us off, we're just going to go from attack and then defense. I'm, I have a whole like spreadsheet here with all the optics listed. And I'm going to go down the list. So to start us off, we've got Sledge. So Sledge has the new hollow right here. And he also has the 1.5x and he's kept his ACOG. A lot of the people uh, have removed their ACOGs. Like they're gone. So that's Sledge's attachments. The SMG 11 has been unchanged. For Thatcher now, his AR-33, he now has the new red dot and the 1.5x. He's kept his ACOG. Now going for the L85 for Thatcher, he's got the new red dot sight as well as the 2.0x, but he's lost his ACOG, right? So moving on, we've got Ash, and we're going to quickly try to fly through this because there's a lot here. So Ash, her G36C, she's lost her ACOG on it and gotten the 1.5x. For her R4C, nothing has actually changed. So once again, moving on to the next operator, we have got Thermite. So Thermite, shotgun's nothing changed. On his 5.56, he's got the same red dot hollow and reflex, but he's now got the 2.0x and he's kept his ACOG. Nothing else has changed for Thermite in terms of optics. So moving on to Twitch. Her F2, she now has the 1.5x, but no longer the ACOG. Nothing else has changed there. As for the DMR, she has the new 3.0x zoom, which most DMRs now have. I don't want to say all, because I'm not 100% sure, but most DMRs now have the 3.0x. And as you can see, she's lost her ACOG for that. Nothing else has changed there. So moving on again, Monte, nothing's actually changed. Glass, nothing's actually changed. Fuse, there's actually quite a bit that's changed here. So we'll start off the LMG here. So Fuse has now the 1.5X and he's kept his ACOG. Now for his AK, as you can see, he has eight optics, eight. So he's got all the default Russian optics um, and the red dot, hollow, reflex, all those. Now he's also got the 2.0X, the new scope. So that is it for Fuse. Moving on now to Blitz, there's nothing there. IQ has actually seen a change. They've actually nerfed the G8, so we'll quickly go over that really fast. So all they've done is remove the ACOG. That's the nerf to the G8 so far. So no ACOG and no additional scopes. As for the AUG, she now has the new holographic and she's kept her ACOG for the AUG. And for the 552 Commando, she now has this new hollow, which uh, came with knock, and the 1.5 zoom scope. Carrying on now, we're going to move on to Buck. So Buck has actually seen some changes. He now has the 1.5 zoom on his C8 and lost his ACOG. As for the DMR, he once again has that nice 3.0 uh, zoom scope that a lot of the DMRs have received and no more ACOG on that. All right, so Blackbeard. Blackbeard will check out his assault rifle first. So he's got the 1.5X, no ACOG. For the DMR, he has the 3.0 scope and actually the red dot. This red dot, in, in my opinion, is really clean. Um, I really like it. So that is all the changes for Blackbeard. Moving on now to Capitao. So we'll check out the LMG here first. He has six optics on this gun now. So he's got the default red dot, hollow, and reflex that have always been in the game. And now he's also got the 1.5x zoom and the 2.0x zoom uh, along with his ACOG. So that's for the LMG. Now moving on to his para. He's got the new red dot, which again, I really enjoy, and the 1.5x zoom. All right. So moving on now, we've got Habana. Check her primary out really quickly. She's got the same red dot, hollow, and reflex as she's always has. 
but she's now lost her ACOG and received the 1.5x zoom. So that is all the changes for Habana. The Bearing 9 has received no changes in, in terms of optics. Looking at Jackal's uh, C7E now. So he's got the same, again, red dot hollow and reflex that he's always had. He no longer has his ACOG, but he does have this 2.0x uh, zoom scope now. As for the PDW, um, the only thing that's changed is it no longer has an ACOG, but it does have the 1.5x zoom. Moving on now, no other changes for Jackal. Going over to Ying. So there have been a little bit of changes for Ying. So it has the same red dot hollow reflex, the 1.5x zoom, the 2.0x zoom, and she's kept her ACOG on that LMG. And that is actually all that's changed in terms of optics for Ying. Going on to Zofia. So we're gonna check out her LMG E. So she has same default scopes. She has her ACOG, she's kept her ACOG. She has the 1.5x zoom and the 2.0x zoom as well. Onto her assault rifle, the M7. She has the same default scopes, but also the 2.0x zoom and no ACOG now. Remember the ACOG is 2.5 zoom and the, uh, the new scope is 3.0 and i believe 1.50 and yeah 2.5 2.5 1.5 2.5 3.0 .5, carrying on to dokubi so dokubi now has the 3.0 zoom because she has her dmr so that's on the uh, mk14 there as for the boss g she's actually got the 2.5 still she's still got her acog nothing has changed there and that's all for dokubi the smg12 has kept its same optics as before Going on to Lion, Lion's actually seen some cool changes to his guns. So now for the V308, he's got the new red dot, which is awesome. He's got the 2.0x zoom, and he's kept his ACOG. As for his DMR, the 417, he's got the 3.0x zoom, which pretty much all DMRs have now. And that is the only change uh, to that gun. Now going on to Finca, check out her spear. So she's got the default Russian sights and she's also got the 2.0x zoom. Going on to her LMG, she's got the default Russian sights once again. She's also got this 1.5x zoom and she's kept her ACOG. That was all for Finca. Nothing for the shotguns, of course. Going on to Maverick now. So Maverick on his DMR, the AR here, he has the new 3.0x zoom. Nothing else has changed for that gun. Going on to the M4. He has the 1.5x zoom and all the other default skin, or uh, optics, I'm sorry. Carrying on now to who's next? Nomad. Check out her AK-74 first. So she has lost her ACOG on it, but she now has the 2.0x zoom on it. Now going to her ARX, which is my preferred gun on her. She's got the red dot, uh, the new red dot, however. The 1.5x zoom, and she's kept her ACOG on it. Alright, now going on to Gridlock. Gridlock on her F90. She has kept her ACOG, and she's also got the 2.0x zoom, and all the other default sights. As for her M2, the LMG, she has the default sights, as well as the new 1.5x zoom, and the 2.0x zoom, and she's kept her ACOG. Moving on now, once again, we have Knock. So a lot of uh, a really cool thing that I like that they've done is they've added the 1.5 zoom to the FMG9, which is really cool. I actually really like this gun, and uh, with the 1.5 zoom, it actually feels pretty good. So that's a that's a change I like. Um, the rest of these guns have had no no changes for the optics. Going on to Amaro now. So we covered IQ earlier, and we showed how she lost her uh, ACOG on the G8, but Amar who's actually kept the ACOG on the G8 and also gained the 2.0x zoom scope. So if you want to have the ACOG on the G8, you're going to have to play Amaro over IQ. So you're kind of sacrificing your utility there, but for the ACOG. Callie's actually seen no changes, of course. Iana, we'll go to Iana. We'll check out her ARX first. So very similar changes. She's got the red dot. She's got the 1.5x zoom and she's kept her ACOG. Going on to the next gun, the G36C. She has this new hollow sight, and she also has the 2.0x zoom. So no ACOG on the G36 there anymore. All right, moving on to Ace. 
uh, check out his AK. So Ace actually has seen one change. He's gotten rid of his ACOG and he now has the 2.0x zoom scope. As for his shotgun and pistol, they've remained the same in terms of optics. Zero, the new operator on his new gun, we'll check it out, the SC3000K. Uh, this is the new weapon to Siege. Uh, he's got the new red dot, the new hollow, the 1.5x zoom, and the 2.0x zoom. So no ACOG, but he does have most of the new optics. All right, so now for his MP7, we actually have an MP7 on attack now, and it has different attachments than what Bandits has. So he actually has the addition of the 1.5x zoom on his MP7, whereas Bandit does not. So that's going to be all for the attackers. We're going to head over to the defenders now. So we've got Smoke. The, on the FMG9, once again, he has the 1.5x zoom. It's something I really like that they've added to this gun. The shotgun has seen no changes, and the SMG11 has seen no change in optic. Going on to Mute. Similar story here, the shotgun and the SMG-11 have seen no optic changes, whereas the MP5K has got the new red dot, the new hollow, and also the 1.5x. Carrying on now to, who's next? Castle. So this is actually a really interesting change. So they've added the 1.5x zoom to Castle, whereas on Pulse they have not. Um, so this kind of... I like this a lot actually. I, I really enjoy the addition of that and, and once again no changes to the shotguns um, or anything like that in terms of optics. Going on to Pulse, as we had just talked about, Pulse does not have the new 1.5x scope but he does have the new holographic sight uh, to replace the old holo. Um, okay, so next up we got Doc. So this is going to be something that a lot of people are going to be talking about, I'm sure. Doc has lost his ACOG on the MP5. And his sense got the 1.5 bucks. Um, personally, I like this. If you guys have watched my videos before, you know that I only run the holographic for the most part. So you'll probably see me run the 1.5 um, here and there. But for the most part, I usually only run hollow. So for me, this is fine. Um, a lot, I know a lot of people may be upset about this. But honestly, once you get your hands on the 1.5x, um, I think you guys will like it. So for the P90, you've got the new holographic sight and the 1.5x. No ACOG anymore and no old hollow sight. So that's it for Doc. Going on to Rook now. We're gonna have a similar change here to Rook. So on the P90, we'll start with this. You got the new red dot, you got the old hollow, the and the 1.5x, and that's all the changes to his optics. Um, of course, with the um, ACOG being removed. Going back to his MP5 now, he has the 2.0 zoom. So if you want to play um, for a higher level of zoom on the MP5, they're gonna have to take take a uh, Rook over Doc. So that's uh, that's a change there. Of course, all the shotguns, everything, no optic changes. Going on to Capcom now for his um, little SMG here. He's got the addition of the 1.5x zoom and no other changes there. And of course, his shotgun and all that has remained the same in terms of optics. As for Tachanka, you see the same change that you see with um, Capcom. So you have the 1.5x zoom and the other default scopes. So moving on once again. We have Jaeger, and this change I actually really like a lot. So Jaeger's actually had the addition of the new red dot scope. Um, his old red dot has been taken out with the uh, addition of this red dot scope. I actually really, really like this scope. It's very, very clean. So that's the change to Jaeger. Going on again to Bandit. Bandit has actually seen no change, I believe. Yeah, no change on Bandit. Same optics, no 1.5x zoom like... Uh, zero has going on to frost now Oop, frost not valkyrie so for her smg she now has the 1.5x zoom and no other changes there her shotgun and all that remaining the same moving on to valkyrie now for her mpx you now see no changes okay for cavera gonna go to her smg you have no changes as well. A lot of uh, a lot of these changes were mainly on the attack side, but you have still a few on defense. So going to Echo now, this is actually we're going to start to see changes again. So on his MP5 SD, you no longer have your ACOG, but you do have your 1.5x. So if you really like spawn picking with like Echo, Doc, Rook, um, Rook's probably going to be the best for just spawn picking now, uh, solely because he has the two times zoom. And whereas Doc and uh, Echo with the MP5 SD and the MP5 only have the 1.5x. So moving on again, the Bearing 9 has seen no um, additional optics. 
going on to Mira now. Actually, a really cool change for Mira is she now has the 1.5x zoom on her vector with no other changes. And that is all for Mira. So going on to Legion now. Legion with his T5 has the addition of the 1.5x zoom with no other changes. Carrying on, we have Ella. Ella's actually seen no changes as well to her SMG in terms of optics. So you have all the same optics that you had before. Going on now to Vigil. I believe Vigil has not seen any changes as well. Let's double check. Yep, so no changes for Vigil here in terms of optics. Uh, the the um, Bashi has also kept a decog. The SMG-11 has remained the same in terms of optics. So no changes there. Going on to Maestro. So you actually do have a change with Maestro, but it's not on his Alda. His Alda has the same optics, but you do see a change on his um, shotgun here. So you have the new red dot. And that's going to be the same with Alibi. So we won't even go to Alibi. It's, it's just the same change. There's no uh, no additional changes to Alibi. Clash, of course, has remained the same. Go to Cade now. The AUG here has seen the addition of the new red dot scope and the 1.5x zoom. And the shotgun has the 2.0x with the uh, ACOG taken off. So that's the changes to Cade. Going on now to Mozzie. So let's check both of his guns really quickly. So you have the default scopes for the Commando 9. As, as for the P10, you have also the default optics. Nothing has changed there. Continuing on now, we have Warden with the MPX. So the MPX actually has the new holographic sight as well as the 1.5x. Um, so that's uh, that's for Warden. As for his other guns, again, you have no changes to his pistol, the SMG-12, or the shotgun in terms of optics. Going on now to Goyo. Goyo on his vector, you do not actually see the 1.5x on it as you do with Mira. And his uh, TCSG shotgun, you also see that 2.0x zoom scope on it with the no ACOG. So that is for Goyo. Now on to Wumai. We'll check out his AUG first. So as you can see, the AUG has the new holographic sight, but um, the red dot and the reflex are the same as they were before. But you now switched out the old holo with this new one. As for his MP5K, you see the addition of the 1.5x zoom and nothing else changed there. So now for Orcs, our second to last operator here, for the MP5, you have the new hollow and nothing else has changed there. As for our last operator here, we have Malusi. So for her T5, as you can see, nothing has changed. And nothing has changed for her shotgun or her pistol. So that is covering up all the actual optics on who gained an a or who was um, gained a new scope, who had their ACOG taken away, had their old red dot or their old hollow taken away. That is all of that for every single operator currently in the game uh, we'll quickly go over these settings so you have this new uh, sorry you have this new section in the settings tab and this is the accessibility so this is where you can change your preset color for your for your reticle color so personally I like uh, purple but you can change yours to whichever color that you want so this will change the when you're when you're aim down sights, for example, on the reflex, the triangle will be uh, whichever color you set in here. So personally, I play purple, and then uh, continue with the reflex example, the little triangle. If you turn down the opacity, it gets um, lighter and lighter. It fades out more and more. Um, personally, I stay on 100, and I like purple, but uh, that is the changes to that. As for the controls, you can see the sensitivity has changed slightly. So you've now got your, your horizontal and vertical, that's remained the same. Now you also have your ADS sensitivity. So you have the option of playing standard. So if you change this, it changes everything. Or you can go to advanced and you can individually change each, um, each magnifi uh, magnification for every scope. So 1.0x, 1 1.5, 2.0, 2.5, 3.0, 4.0, 5.0, uh, 12.0 all that you can change each individually for each scope in the game so you can do your math and if you want to make it one to one or whatever you want to do um personally i keep it on standard and i just put it on 45 just because i'm kind of in the test build and i haven't had time to kind of go through and test which i want each scope to be on sensitivity wise i'll probably do that when uh season actually comes out but that is the changes to the sensitivity and all of the 
uh, the reticles and the optics and all that that are all the changes to all the operators and all the guns so i hope you guys enjoyed the video thanks for watching i appreciate it um if you guys wouldn't mind liking and subscribing commenting on the video whatever helps me out a bunch uh again huge shout out to ubisoft for letting me uh test out all this new stuff and everybody that's supporting me and helping me get to this point it's actually crazy i never expected this to have ever happened but uh i really do appreciate it so thank you guys for watching the video and have a nice day